Hello everyone, so this is Idle Research, and I have been working on a quest system for adventure. Now before I show quests, I'm going to show the adventure real quick because I'm sure most of you don't know what I'm talking about because you aren't on my Discord, and if you aren't, make sure you join, it's in the description below. But so this is what adventure looks like, so you have uh, you fighting against enemy tubes, and you can, uh, there's infinite amount of stages. There's nine different zones, and see so yeah, there's lava, uh, soda, and cheese. So um, the further you get, the stronger they get, obviously. And every time you kill them, you get blue energy. You also get skill shards. So that is for skills, which isn't really that important. Just that you have a small chance of getting uh, skill shards. So now for the quests. So for the quests, you have three, up to three different slots of quests. Um, you start with an unassigned quest, and you can change the size of the quest. So colossal being the biggest, it'll take the longest, and molecular taking the, the shortest. So I'm gonna be showing a molecular quest just to get to the point. So basically, when you start a quest, it costs mystical shards, which you get from uh, the mastery prestige which is basically prestige system for your two mastery. So it resets everything related to two mastery and you get mystical shards for that. So let's start this quest. So it wants us to go to cheese factory stage four and we have to gather 450,000 of the cheese fragments. Oh, see, it's already starting to collect them. So let's head there real quick. Oh, we're already here. Every time you kill, you get blue energy, you get fragments and you also have a small chance, approximately 25%. That's just the drop chance right now to get skill shards. So right now, you can see I'm getting more, and we'll wait for this quest to finish. Okay, so we have gathered enough fragments, let's check out the quest. So we can complete the quest, and we will get back our mystical shards, and we'll also get some quest shards. There you go, we just gained 18, and now we can use these to buy uh, quite a bit of upgrades here. So the thing about mystical shards is that you spend them to start the quest, you can cancel the quest and you'll get them back, or if you just complete the quest, you'll also get them back as well. So the thing about these is that right now, I'm basically not able to do a massive quest. And these are good for like overnight runs or something like that, or even colossal. So really the point of getting these back is to determine how many quests we can do at once and also how big they can be. So right now, I can pretty much only do a small, up to small quest. Otherwise, just molecular, or tiny, or small. This is the quest system I have implemented in Idle Research. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and join the Discord below if you want to see more previews.